Whenever life blindsides you, it's time to go into a coma. Just kidding. It's time for a check-in. In this video, I show you just how I got my head in check during my darkest days. If you want to skip the painful story, just go ahead and skip to the technique that will show you at the end of this video. It's well worth it because it is one of the major things that allowed me to feel like myself again. Let me tell you what happened. I was married, then I realized I'd messed up. I'd woken up and I was on the wrong path. Overall, the life I was living wasn't for me. As I transitioned away from that life, the results were devastating. Anxious, depressed, mad, sad, that was me. At the time, I ran a service-based business. Due to my mindset, all that stress, I had to give it up. I wasn't much great company. However, I wasn't ready to give up. I know a lot of guys in my age bracket, they succumb to the pressures and they take their own life. This is a story about how I averted that statistic. Luckily, I found power in research, books and information, self-help books, really helped as well as YouTube. One particular episode of the Joe Rogan podcast on YouTube featured this crazy lunatic kind of Dutchman called Wim Hof. Maybe you can see where I'm going. Apparently his breathing techniques were curing stuff. At least that's what they said. This was good enough for me. I had to find out more and that's what I did. I stopped crying with another realization. I started to learn how to let it go. Of course, reading self-help books and Wim Hof, that's how you get happy in life, right? Well, no. This was just the beginning. When I first heard about Wim Hof, I was terrified of my stress. I had a baby on the way. I had no guarantee of income from week to week. It really was a nightmare. So I researched and practiced the Wim Hof breathing technique which you'll see towards the end of the video. This allowed me to be functional in everyday life while I was cleaning up the mess that I'd created. As time went on, things improved and I even found a wonderful woman to spend life with. I taught her and our kids the techniques that I'd learned and we began doing it together. Eventually, I found passion for life in a whole new way. I fell even more in love with cooking than when I started. And I found another business to get into. The one thing that started it all was choosing to improve and giving myself the never give up ultimatum. The Wim Hof breathing technique was instrumental in changing my mental state in the moment and over the years. Beyond the personal gain, the technique has filtered down into a family. We don't always do it together. I probably do it more than anyone else, but it's allowed the kids to be more focused when they're getting too hyped up and having trouble with the daily grind of their school studies. Now, the moment you've all been waiting for, the Wim Hof breathing technique demonstrated by myself and my two lovely daughters. Enjoy this glimpse into the technique. If you'd like to see the full technique, I've created a separate video just for you. Please click on this link here and it'll take you straight there for the full technique. Before um, breathing, me and my sister was having a fight and then she kept on bashing me up and then I was crying. It really hurt and after I finished breathing, I just felt really relaxed. I love you. I love you. I have these tools and there's so many others that I could bring to your attention. But right now it's about the Wim Hof technique. What I'd suggest to you is to go check out that other video about the technique and put in place a daily system where you practice three rounds, either in the morning, in the lunchtime or in the evening, whenever it suits you and you do it for a period in time. Why not try a 30 day challenge of your own? The benefits to me outweigh the risks. So feel free to do your reading, 
check out YouTube and see what the reviews are like, you are going to have the choice of an improvement that you never once thought possible. Have the most wonderful day and I'll see you in the next video.